Got a good one for my solar client in Tennessee today. Um, called a 225,000 square foot manufacturing facility about two weeks ago. Got a hold of the KDM there. He said they're owned by a parent company. He said he would reach out to him. I emailed him, never heard anything back. Emailed him today. He gave me the email and phone number for their uh, head of environmental compliance for the entire company in North America. Called him, he sent me a voicemail, emailed him, he emailed me back, said, hey, I want to hear about your company. I have some time tomorrow for a virtual meeting. Got one for Riverland Roofing out in Memphis. Sixth one for them on the month. It's a charter school and church combined. They've had active issues in the past. They tried to fix it. The issues keep coming up. So we're going out there on Thursday of this week. They're looking for a potential re-roof on both the church and the school, so hopefully that should be a good opportunity. I got a call back from a lead this morning. I had been trying to reach this guy for a few months, left him a few voicemails. It turned out he wrote my information down. I haven't called in a while. He gave me a call this morning, told me that one of their buildings had been having some leaks. He's the facility director for a school and asked for a quote and repairs. So we will be going out next week. What did we have yesterday? What was yesterday? 18. 18. 18 is a pretty good remote day. So we got six today. What uh, what's a good one? What's a, what's an exciting one, James? Uh, so I called this company. They were a subsidiary of an international company uh, out in Tennessee. The director of VHS on site. He's like, hey, uh, we're looking at solar for this facility. We've got a net zero goal. Um, send me an email. I emailed him two weeks ago. Didn't reply. Emailed him this morning. He's like, all right, here's our corporate head for this stuff in North America. I call him. Called him. Forwarded immediately voicemail shot him an email and he's like, yeah, I've got some time tomorrow and need to uh, take a look at what you guys do. Um, this is definitely on our radar for this site. So 225,000 square feet plus 90 acres they own alongside. Um, this would be a good spot to build out a nice field to achieve net zero goals, but we will see. Who else? Uh, I got a pretty good one for my Houston client. I spoke with the property manager at the beginning of December for the first time. She pushed me off until uh, now and then I got her on the phone. She said that they have three buildings they need re-roofed. Uh, we're going out there tomorrow because they're leaking pretty bad, and they have a new property management company, so uh, they're willing to spend money. So as long as we get them a good proposal, they said that it'll close. So, so what do we have to do? Yeah, I had a lead no response actually call me early this morning. I gave him a call back. Uh, it's a private Christian school. Called me back, told me one of the buildings is having some active leaks, needs us to come out. Apparently, left him, when I left him by the last voicemail, he wrote it down and called me back about a month later. So, yeah, we'll be going out next week. I had a good one for Ramco. I had reached out to her when I first got the account at the beginning of last month. They started with us, and she just let me know they've been with a few cleaners over the past year or two, and they were kind of just trying to find somebody that worked for them. And, they're currently with a company that they didn't hate and they were kind of breaking some ground with, but I still pitched for us to come out and, you know, just put some numbers in their back pocket and show them what we do. And uh, she said reach out after the first of the year. Finally did that. She was open to us coming out. She uh, wanted us to come out tomorrow, but scheduled school, so Thursday. Uh, is that for me? Yeah, that's 10 for Ramco this month, and I got four proposal numbers I'm waiting on. And I think there's probably two or three more added on there by now. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, that's great. 10 is awesome. Right, if we're winding three to six, that's the range we want to be in, but overperforming is very good. Have they written us a Google review? I'll ask for as soon as I get those numbers. I'm going to try to sit down on a phone call with them this week and just update all 20 appointments I've gotten over the last two months. Great job, great job, Tom. Who else? Any other deals, proposals? I got a proposal out, or Creative IT got a proposal out for just under three grand a month. It was actually an appointment I set up for them yesterday afternoon. Uh, she said that she wanted two weeks to review an MSP for their MSP right now, and she asked for 10. I was like, I'm up nine, and she was like, that's what I actually wanted. So, Matt had a really good meeting, already scheduled a second meeting for the sixth. So, I've got another proposal out. Um, we sent them three different options for repairs. Uh, the top number was around $46,000. STP got out a proposal for 27K. Mm. Uh, I had one for uh, NDSC. It's, uh, it was 2,000 in hardware and 3,500 monthly recurring, so looking to sign next week. Scotty's got one. Scotty's got one. I got a uh, proposal out for a school and a church here in St. Louis. It's 330. 
thousand dollars. Um, it's a pretty big community center slash church, and uh, it w- went from one million to down to three hundred thirty thousand with all the the rebates and incentives they're getting. So they're super excited about it. Got a great one for one of our IT clients in California today. Followed up president of the company last year, said it's a three-year plan for evaluations. Got a hold of them today, said it's the perfect time. We got the meeting scheduled for coming up next Monday. They have 30 users, three servers, already partially migrated to the cloud, and two locations, and we're excited for it. Yeah, so I got one today for my roofers over in Portland. Turns out the building's actually losing some shingles property manager I talked to said she's noticed some on the ground so obviously told her we'd like to get up there take a look at it make sure everything's going well she also mentioned that the property owner is looking at getting bids for an entire re-roof on the property so we'll be out there I want to say Thursday morning should be a pretty good one